Tony at Six Degrees Space Limited, uh, and uh, uh, you're going to tell us what you're showcasing at iZone here today. Sure. We have uh, a new optical sensor. that You have this right here inside our little toy man, which is used to do rotation and positional tracking for virtual reality headsets. And if I show you our little demo right here, we have some arbitrary lights set up in a room, and this man with the headset tracker in his head. and. If you look over here at the screen, as I rotate the man, we're getting a bearing reading out, showing exactly which way he's pointing at a very, very high accuracy and a very, very low latency. So we're able to track at about a millisecond response time. You can move him around and you can see I see tracks as you do it. And the idea is to reduce the latency in uh, virtual reality. Okay. For people today, when they turn their head and they see what they're pointing at, and then it takes a while for the image to update, okay. and that's what causes the nausea and all the I see. So the this would be something would be integrated with the virtual reality headset that's to correct. make it a little more um, efficient in terms of latency. Exactly. It right. Would be so built tell into a manufacturer's headset and replace the existing or complement the existing inertial motion units they have today or these uh, complicated external beacons that people put in these high-end headsets. And by using this little optical sensor, I could just yeah. show it to you right here. Yeah. This is the, the complete module. All you need to do is embed that in your headset, run the algorithms that we've developed behind it, and then you have a complete six degrees of tracking. Okay, so tell us a little bit about what's unique. Is it the algorithm that's uh, behind the sensor that, that's making the difference in terms of latency? The algorithm or? is part of it, but the, the main, I guess, invention here is yeah. the optics that goes into the sensor. Okay. Is the way we take the room image and we could compress it down into a data set, which is much easier to process, and we can process much faster. So we don't have to look at a giant image of the entire room. We just extract the important features, okay. and we track those, <laughs> and then we can process them very quickly and very accurately. Okay, excellent. And uh, tell us how your experience been so far at the iZone. Uh, well, it's just got started. Uh, we've been here for a couple hours, and yeah. it's been great so far. A lot of people come by, and we're getting the exposure that we hope to get, meeting all the uh, key players in the industry. Okay, excellent. Good luck. Thank you very much. Yep.